Hi, welcome. So today um, I was asked for a favor which I was very happy to be a part of. So my friend called me up and let me know that her younger sister is starting out on a modeling career and she wanted me to do her makeup for her. So yay, I got to do someone's makeup, um, a model, an upcoming model. Yeah, so um, I just wanted to share with you the process and um, a few shots from, not from the modeling shoot, but from my own <laughs> personal modeling shoot of her so um, we're just gonna be going through the makeup process and um, the final look and I hope you like it um, some parts of the the makeup process were not part of the video because I thought I was recording but I wasn't I'm so sorry about that but next time I'll try to be on point with my recording so I hope you enjoy this and I'll see you later bye all right so we're applying the primer now this primer is by Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics, OCC Cosmetics. So just apply that with your fingertips. You can apply it with a brush or you can apply it with a sponge. I'm choosing here to apply it with my fingertips because I feel it's quicker and you can apply it more. So let's see. And so this uh, is the, an airbrush foundation by Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics in the color Y5. She has a yellow undertone to her skin as you can see. So you're just going to apply about 5 to 10 drops of foundation into the cup. You can always add more foundation if it isn't enough but it's always best to start with the lightest application possible. And make sure your PSI is between about 5 to 8 PSI. That's the pressure for the airbrush compressor. Okay, so right now we're just trying to conceal a blemish she has up on her forehead. I think it's a scar. It looks like a burn. So here we're not using any traditional foundation or concealer. We're using the makeup from the airbrush fan. Just apply lightly and then dry up. It's always best to apply in light coats as opposed to spraying on a heavy amount and trying to dry that it'll just drip down so just apply lightly and then dry dry with the air from the gun so just make sure you apply the foundation flawlessly all over the skin try to get the neck as well so you can blend it that's a great thing about airbrush foundation you can easily so yeah just applying the blush with the airbrush gun and after that eyeshadow time sorry I couldn't record my eyeshadow process um, it was a mistake by me I thought I was recording it but it wasn't but you can just see um, some of the colors I used I used the gold at the base I used the um, a reddish tone at the crease and I also used the dark shadow a gray shadow and the dark brown shadow at the to highlight to shadow the area to make to create a smoky eye and I used the light brown around the brow bone and I just highlighted that a bit more with the gold colored eyeshadows for this eyeshadow application I used the, the coastal scent palette and then the just um, shade the brows and line your eyes and apply mascara time for the lips So for the lips, we're just going to be using the burgundy colored lip liner and a brown one as well to contour the area. And we're going to be using a lip stain from e.l.f. as our main lip color. And we're just going to gloss that up with a lip gloss. So this is the lip stain and we're just going to apply right now a lip gloss from Bare Essentials from their Boxum collection. So just apply that generously. And finally, just set your makeup with a loose powder. So finally, just set your makeup with the loose powder. Usually, you don't have to set airbrush foundation with powder. But I'm just going to do that just to smoothen out everything and take out any extra shine. This loose powder is by Prescriptives. It's a company that closed down last year, so you probably won't find it anymore. So just make sure you dust that lightly all over the face. Don't brush it on, just dust it lightly. And then try to cover the neck as well, just to even out the coverage and to prevent any streaks or lines. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so this is the final makeup look. Sorry I didn't have the full tutorial because I, I didn't record some parts. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you soon. I'm going to be having my own mini photo shoot before her main photo shoot. And um, I hope you enjoy my pictures. Stay tuned for the pictures. Bye bye and see you next time. Touch my hand, squeeze me like a bear I come to life and show you how a man supposed to care For you there, for you I'll be like your spare For you I'll give you my strong team My strong team If yeah. there's no more game, we catch my eye I see I'm for sure, I see I'm for sure I've never seen a girl that looks so fly Is she alone? I'm wondering, is she alone? Girl, I know gon' let you walk go by Can we take it slow, baby, take it slow Too many questions running through my mind